dashboard. Every user in Moodle has their own personal page called their dashboard. On many Moodle sites, you're taken to the dashboard once you log in. If not, you can get to it by clicking the link in the user menu. It's a page where you'll have an overview of the courses that you're enrolled in with any activities that need to be given attention to. For example, in the Teaching with Moodle course here, there are forum posts which need to be read. You can customise your dashboard by clicking the Customise this page button and you can change the page back to the site default by clicking the Reset button. One useful thing is you can decide how many of your enrolled courses to display. So if you only have a couple as here, you'll want to show all of them. If you're enrolled in many courses, you can choose to show just a few with a link to the others at the bottom. It's also possible to rearrange the order of the courses. So for example, by clicking and dragging, you can move particular courses up and down. There are blocks that you can add to your dashboard if you think they'll be useful. If we go to the Add Block drop-down, it might be helpful to add the Online Users block, which will show you who's online at the same time as you. In another video, we'll look at the different blocks and what they do. On the dashboard, you can move blocks into the central section, either by dragging them and dropping them as here, or you can click on the crosshairs icon and then select an area under which a block will reappear. Let's choose Calendar and see how this works. When you've finished organising your dashboard, click the Stop Customising This Page button.